Good day and welcome to puzzle number 39. What number is represented by the question mark? The numbers in the puzzles are as follows. In the first row, we have 4, 6 and 12. In the second row, we have 7, 5 and 18. And in the final row, we have 3, 9 and the question mark. As usual, we need to know what number can be represented by the question mark. If you want to have a go at this puzzle, press the pause button now. But if you want to know the solution, keep watching. Welcome back to the solution of puzzle number 39. What number is represented by the question mark? The numbers in the puzzles are 4, 6, 12 in the first row, 7, 5, 18 in the second row, and 3, 9 in the question mark in the final row. So have you found the answer? If you have not, I will give you the answer straight away. So you can either work on rows and columns whenever you have a table, but in this case, it looks more likely to be in terms of rows, okay? Because rows, the numbers, the biggest number are all at the end of the column. So 4, 6 equal to 12, 7, 5 equal to 18, and 3, 9 equal to question mark. How you do that? The trick is that in the first column, every number in the first column, you are going to minus by 1. And every number in the second column, you are going to minus by 2. Let's work it out, okay? 4 minus 1 is going to be 3. 7 minus 1 is going to be 6. And 3 minus 1 is going to be 2. In the second column, you minus 2. 6 minus 2 is going to be 4. 5 minus 2 is going to be 3. And 9 minus 2 is going to be 7. So what you're going to do, you're just going to multiply the two numbers. 3 times 4. 3 times 4 gives you 12. 6 times 3 is going to be 18. And 2 times 7, question mark, is going to be equal to 14. I believe most of you will get it right because you guys are geniuses and I see you in the next one. Cheers everyone and have a good day and subscribe for more puzzles. Cheers.